I just harvested our first Maypop fruit. Um, I don't know enough about this variety yet, so I don't necessarily harvest it like I do, but this popped. Um, that's the title, Passion Flower. Oh, look, you can see here's another fruit is beginning to grow within the old flower. Um, this is so cool. I've wanted this plant to grow in my yard for like five years, and it attracts these golf fritillary butterflies. So I planted it like five years ago, but we just didn't have the right shade. So then when this false indigo tree, this is like the indigo leaves, took off, it was like the perfect habitat for this thing to go. So we've got, um, we put in this climbing arch for it and you can just see how happy these butterflies are. I'm surrounded, <laughs> it's the best. So I came out here to look at this fruit and I was like, check out all these caterpillars. These are the same, these orange butterflies you see, this is their larva. And I just started looking around and they are everywhere. Let's see how many, like maybe when you go back and look at this video, you'll see even more than I can see while I'm filming. If you have a caterpillar aversion, don't come to my house. But this is like the first time I've come outside looking and it's like, they're all here. Oh, um, let's see if you can see this one hiding in the shade. So that is, my, I believe it's the native variety of passion flower. I don't see the purple flowers right now. I hope that the caterpillars leave some of this plant for us because I'm wondering if these butterflies are laying a bunch of eggs right now. So I hope you're having a really butterfly or whatever makes you happy day wherever you are. Bye friends.